let's look at this jam physics question on momentum the question here says a 15 gram bullet traveling at 300 meter per second strikes and is absorbed by a 75 kilogram object find the speed with which the object moves off okay so let's get this done of course solution solution here okay solution here our first task is to list our given parameters now if you look at this you have uh what are the things you have here you have a bullet and you have an object of 75 kilogram so let's list out the parameter let's call the bullet um one let's call the bullet one so if you call the bullet one we can say that given number one m1 which is the mass of the bullet m1 is equal to 15 gram so i have this as 15 gram number two the next thing you have there they said is traveling at 300 meter per second that means the velocity perhaps the initial velocity of the bullet that's one is equal to 300 meters per second what is thought we are given here next up they said strikes and is absorbed by a 75 kilogram object all right so we have the object as two so the mass of the object becomes m2 is equal to 75 kilogram okay um objects find the speed with which the object moves that's the question here now one thing you know is this for this question here the idea is that you have a bullet okay so you have a bullet going towards this direction here and then it meets an object like this okay something like this okay now this bullet now comes here and strikes this object here so you have that the bullet strikes this object here and then the object moves perhaps this way here with a certain velocity you have to find the velocity which is v with which the object moves now what to observe here is that for this question here before the bullet strikes the object here the object was at rest okay so the object was not moving in essence we can see that u2 number four u2 that's the initial velocity of the object is zero because the object was not moving when the bullet hits the object okay so in that case we now have this that they said it is absorbed if it, if it is absorbed it means the bullet now would now be inside the object okay so you have a case where the bullet will be inside the objects and then they move together okay you have the bullets being inside the objects and they move together so you have the bullets inside the objects and they move together um, perhaps this way here you're not asked to find the speed at which they move or the velocity at which they move okay the speed now for this case here all right so the question you have here is actually under inelastic collision okay for inelastic collision we say when two bodies collide right they move together as one body okay so they collide they stick together and then move in the same direction with the same speed and you're asked to find the speed with which they moved so for this we we'll now recall the formula recall the formula for inelastic collision the formula you have there is m1 um u1 so you have m1 u1 plus m2 u2 is equal to for inelastic collision you have m1 plus m2 all to v where v is the final velocity with which the objects move together if i put in values m1 so you can see that m1 here is in grams why m2 is in kilograms so let's convert m1 from grams to kilograms this is equal to to convert from grams to kilogram i'll divide by 1000 and if i divide this by 1000 my answer is 0 0.015 in kilogram so m1 is 0 0.015 so i have this as being 0 0.015 in kilogram times u1 u1 is about 300 that becomes 300 plus m2 m2 is about 75 
that becomes 75 into u2 u2 the object was stationary so it's zero it's equal to m1 plus m2 m1 we had the value as 0 0.015 plus m to the value was 75 into v all right let's get this done so if you have 0 0.015 this multiply this by 300 right if i multiply this by 300 i have 4.5 so 4.5 plus 75 times 0 is 0 is equal to if i sum this this gives me 75.015 v so i have 4.5 plus 0 gives you 4.5 it's equal to um 75.015 v from here let's get the value of v i'll have to divide here and also divide here by the coefficient of v the coefficient is 75.015 divide here by 75.015 so this cancel this you have that v the final velocity or the speed is 4.5 divided by 75.015 and my value there is 0 0.06 approximately so i have this as 0 0.06 now i'm bringing values velocity is measured in meter per second right so you have this all right so this question is just a revision of our previous class okay we've discussed everything about momentum and elasticity as well as elastic collision inelastic collision and etc okay I'll leave a link to uh, video tutorials on this in the description, right? So check the video description. You'll see a link to get the full lecture on this topic. Also, I've prepared over 100 tutorial videos for jam buys, okay? So if you're taking the jam or the work exam or even GC exam, do want to visit my website, www.com jumaimari.com forward slash courses and you see the jam slash wire classes all right so make an order for it and then of course it contains over 100 video lessons and answers on physics chemistry mathematics and other science subjects okay so if you're interested just visit my website www.jumaimari.com forward slash courses register an account with the website and then go ahead to place an order for the course all right you can also send a dm to me plus two three four nine zero three two five five eight one six six if you need help with getting the course finally if you enjoyed this video please do want to hit the like button okay so like this video um leave a comment tell us if you enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe if it's your first time or if you're yet to subscribe please do want to subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon so that you get notified whenever we upload a new content then finally share this video to your friends and your colleagues so that they can also learn thank you and see you in our next class